decent. It's not as good as it once was. So here we go, Katana. Mournful. We saw this against Merc. And yeah, he, he, he has to just love the trade that that Glaive gives him over that low projectile. When his when his uh, hands have the flames, though, oh, that projectile damage is so good. You don't want to, no matter who you are, you don't want to trade with it. Silver out, a risky jump into another throw. Dragon just caught blocking. This variation has been in Dragon's head since he played Alien because whether or not, I don't know if it was ever confirmed or not, but Tarkatan versus Flame Fist was a, a horrible matchup for Tarkatan. I don't know if it was ever actually confirmed or if it was just a, a lot of talk, but I think this is one of the cases maybe where Flame Fist may be in Dragon's head. It's coming back. Nice back dash. But pretty much right by Dragon there. Very, very smart stuff. Very good. Down one, almost converted Dragon. He's playing the keep away so well this round. Dragon walks himself back. You gotta be careful. Don't walk yourself in the corner. And Flame one Fist. hit, one hit, and your health could quickly disappear from Flame Fist. Flame Fist, man, it does so much damage in the corner. Especially, like, ooh, and the back dash again, not gonna work. Dragon is reading that all day. Will Silver, uh, okay. I was going to say, the more you keep hitting him with projectiles, he's just going to keep building yeah. that meter. But they're they're about even. Yeah. Two and a half to two and a quarter. Oh, and <laughs> what if... Okay. What a hitbox on but, that. <laughs> what? Down one into the safe kick by Dragon. Forcing Silverite off the meter early. And this is going to look really good for Dragon. He's going to full conversion here, full screen. He's got two bars. I'm not sure with Mournful. Nice backdash again! A double backdash to try to get out of any pressure that could have been caused by that. And this is decent damage, and just just, just look out for a glaive here. To... Ooh, and just missed. Dragon's gonna take match one. That was... Okay. Damage in the corner, especially if he's got one or two bars. Oh, if if, if he's got two bars, it's no longer grow man damage. He's... he's <laughs> it's social security damage in the corner, man. Nice armor by Silver Eye. Knows there's a gap there. He was back dashing it earlier. Figured he would spin the bar. And that hot flame is just... It's just not enough. Nice throw by Dragon. Silver Eye down to about 25%. This has to be so frustrating to deal with. Especially because Dragon has so much of the level behind him. So much of the stage. And that's gonna be a punish for Dragon. He's gonna take round one. If he doesn't, he does drop it. And the poke into the safe kick. <laughs> round two, fight. Oh, Dragon look, just looks so comfortable being able to stay away and then just make his approaches kind of at his own command. Yeah, you're 100% right. He looks so comfortable just staying away, especially with those, those air glaives. Ooh. Decides to block it. Oh, Here we nice go. Nice crossover by Silver. And oh, a big drop. It. Not even so much damage, but he gets a lot of chip damage here. Lots of chip. Oh, oh and that's that a should punish. do it. Dragon. Okay. I think Dragon just threw that round to get that little bit more meter. Now he has an X ray. And that low into an overhead X ray. Oh, no, he doesn't. Silver Eye's got to stay, he's got to confirm off of that. Down one, into a throw. And a great nice. reversal Silver there, and, and Dragon has been pressing a lot of buttons after those glaives. It's a very good stuff by Silver Eye, just to, just to kind of knock him off that uh, pattern that he was falling into. No anti-air from Silver Eye. Nice damage by Dragon, 34%. Only cost him one bar. His, we've not seen his assassin, I don't think, this week at all. And look at the recovery from the Glade. Just being able to throw that EX and just, instead of an EX trade, Ooh, very nice gets the duck. Oh my goodness, and it, it beat out the backhand of Silver Eye. 
has got to confirm off this. A down two. Woo. And Silverite back in this match. Yeah, just mentally, it looked like Silver Eye was close to just being in in the grasp of Dragon. And here we go, keep keeping his composure. We'll see if he can ride it. Silver caught, not blocking on the way back. And I, I like this. Silver Eye just a minute ago did an air fireball just to contest with those air glaives. Because his high fireball will not reach that height. A nice backhand by Silver. He is just about 5% health. This is not a good place to be with all this chip to take. That projectile is a mid. And Dragon looks in our other. Go ahead. He looks back in control like he, like he did early. Just keeping Silver Eye off him. This is a zoning. War. You don't want to get hit by flame fist fireballs when he's got that flame active. The trade is in nobody's favor. Good blocks. Dragon coming in with the safe kick. Tried to jump out. Silver Eye with the backhand. Oh, and no punish. And uh, Silver Eye went for some good damage there because he tried to mix him up. With it, instead of the, the low fireball that he's done a few times and going with the overhead, you EX it for some extra damage there. Oh, and it just missed. Okay, health is just about even. Good down one check by Silver. And this great spacing by Silver. That's going to take the round. Just the quick walk back and throw out the. What a great space right there. Liu Kang has some of the best walk speed, especially his back walk speed. He can bait you into jumping in so easy and trip guard you. One of the few characters that doesn't really have to fall into that trap, Katana. Right, he can just walk right back, doesn't care about the flow. Let me just see what you do real quick. It's nice fireball by Silver Rock. Good boomerang by Dragon. Oh, and a very nice jump back. Almost got the conversion. Oh There's no, Silver Rock coming off his bar. But gets Dragon off of his too. Silver Eye. And he has to so find his lane with, with no stamina. That's going to do it. And that's that's where you see that huge game change from NRS. Oh my god. And then sometimes get punished. But here we go. Dragon on, got two wins over Silver. Good block by Silver Eye. That down one into the kick is, is just so dirty. And it's safe. We'll see if Silver Eye can bring this thing all the way back. He's gonna have to stick it out with Flame Fist. He's got to, he's got to contest those jumps. He gets he gets Dragon in the corner so often, but Dragon just jumps right out because of the threat of that float. You don't want to hit a button too early or too late, because then you're gonna especially mournful in the corner. Good damage. Thirty. Look at this grown man damage from Dragon. 42% puts him back in the corner, goes for a throw, another throw. And Silver's, ooh, and a parry. That's the first parry we have seen him throw out, and that is so good. That is what turned the tide against Sonic, and Dragon takes round one. I've noticed from Dragon, he's just not falling for any of the staggers Silver is trying to throw at him. He's just counter poking, using the hit stun to take his turn. It's honestly brilliant play by Sonic. You mean dragon? Oh, just or, or, yeah, I'm sorry. What did I say? What did I say? I said Sonic? Yeah. yeah. Sonic Fox, uh, who, all, who's, who's also no slouch of Katana. That, yeah, that's true. And look at the zoning that Katana's recovery just beating out almost anything Luke Kang does. Every projectile he tries to counter zone, she's already recovered and ducking or able to jump over a block. The dragon's going to take this. And that is it. it. Smart play by Dragon. Welcome to the next bracket, sir.